Hi everyone, I want to just share a little script that I wrote um, to basically make use of tube mixing. So tube mixing is this really neat little program uh, that uh, is available for Linux and for Mac. That's just a great YouTube kind of radio. You can search for songs and um, basically just it has this cool thing called smart mode. I think, yeah, smart mode. So basically you do a search, you create a playlist, and then it just uses um, information from the video past uh, or extracted from YouTube to get a sense of what kind of music you want to listen to, and it'll just go and use YouTube as a great big radio. Now, um, a really cool thing about this program called Tube Mixing is that um, it saves the videos, I think as MP4s probably, or maybe as uh, FLVs, I'm not sure. But whatever it is, it saves them in a folder called Tube Mixing in the temp folder. So there you go. Now you see, if you are familiar with YouTube naming, you or if you ever look at the URL, you see that the last string is the string that appears in the YouTube URL of that video. Uh, forget, uh, now Tube Mixing uh, chose this particular song. I didn't choose it. Anyway. <sighs> Moving along. Um, so I wrote a string, I wrote a little uh, script, sorry it's late, uh, where what I want to do was fetch the, uh, take that uh, information that I've got from the file name and fetch the data using uh, gdata.youtube.com feeds API videos. Then that would just give me um, a great big block of text of video information and uh, then what I'm going to do with that text is pass it to fi find the actual title of the video and then just copy a file, basically make a copy of that video file into another folder with the name of the uh, video as it appears in YouTube. So for example, if we were to take, uh, I don't know, we'll take any, any old one. So if we go here and we take that final string and then we open up a uh, terminal or actually if we just go to probably YouTube and just paste that in here for the moment and I'll just get this here the I feeds videos and back here it'll just give me a file with all the information. As you can see it's basically all the kind of metadata and if you look closely you'll see that it gives you the title. So title type and here better off alone. May Day 13 better off alone. Now I wanted to just extract this from all of this and uh, Python came to the rescue. So basically you get you use wget if you're on Linux, which you should be, <laughs> and um, then you basically get the information using this. It gives you a text file, I just like to name it text, and then use um, regular expression to find the bit of text between this string, type text, and this string here, title content, which if you have a look here, I'll just zoom in for you. See? So type equals text and title content. So that way you're guaranteed to get what you want, which is the string here. <coughs> so it gets that and you just call that M or title info and then you just I, I was just being lazy I just use oes.system I know I should have made a process but I can't be bothered anyway um, so here's how it works in action so I've uh, got it to dump uh, rename videos into here and all I do is I just I've renamed these files so I take that string and I'll just clear for you. 
and I've called the um, script g data YouTube. What's the YouTube file name? That's the name as that YouTube gives it, and away it goes. And there we are. So um, you can find my um, you can find my script if you go to my paste bin, which is uh, I'll just find a few. Yeah. So if you look me up on Pastebin, I'm Clockwork PC, as you can see here, Clockwork PC, and the uh, this exact paste is available here. Um, I'll just put it in the video information. So uh, I hope that this uh, script is useful to you in one way or another, and thanks for watching.